Hey everyone and welcome to the Sana Commerce screencast. In this demo I will tell you about how to configure and use payments based on prepayments rules. At first let's open Sana Admin and go to Setup, Ordering and Checkout. Under the Ordering tab there is an option Online Payments for B2B customers. As you can see business customers can pay based on prepayment rules which can be set in Microsoft Dynamics NAV, on account and online through a payment service provider. So which type of payment will be used for business customers is determined by this option. In this demo we will talk about payments based on prepayment rules. This type of payment is available only for B2B customers and when the order order type is used. When this payment type is used you need to set up prepayments in Microsoft Dynamics NAV. In NAV prepayment percentage can be set per customer or per item. If prepayment percentage is set for a customer, then it will be used for all items ordered by this customer. If prepayment percentage is set for a customer and for an item purchased by this customer, the one set on the item card will be used. To set up prepayment percentage for a customer, it can be done on the customer card under the Invoicing Fast tab. If prepayment percentage is set for a customer and equals to zero, it will result in working as full amount paid on account payment type. If you want to set up prepayment percentage for an item, then open the item card, switch to the Navigate tab and in the Sales area click Prepayment Percentages. In the Sales Type column set whether the prepayment percentage of an item should be applied to some specific customer or to all customers. If for a specific customer, this customer should be selected in the Sales Code field. And enter the prepayment percentage. When a business customer is placing an order in the web store, the prepayment amount of the order is shown on the payment information and order overview checkout steps. When the order is placed, the prepayment percentage is also stored in the sales order in Microsoft Dynamics NAV. Well, that's it for this demo. Thank you for watching.